good to go. Uh, Sunday, Monday, we'll be watching closely for the radar. So let's start off satellite and radar combined with the clear skies out there this morning. It's a nice start. Well, plenty of sunshine when it comes up about 615 this morning. The radar is dry right now. And it stays dry today, but once we bring back the shower chance tomorrow, it's going to stick around all the way through the day on Monday. So look at those clear skies and a little crescent moon on your way out this morning. You can see it there on the eastern horizon, getting ready for our sun to come up. We're at 58. The dew point very comfortable at 52. The winds are calm, so really a pleasant start this morning when our sun comes up. Temperatures this afternoon very doable. We'll eventually bring back a couple of clouds, becoming partly cloudy for the midday, maybe even mostly cloudy by this evening. There is rain out there, but it's off to the west. It's just going to send mainly mid and high level clouds out ahead of it during the day today. We still have that very low dew point, that very dry air at the surface will not overcome that for any precipitation to start the weekend. Helping us out with dry conditions. Here's our area of high pressure. It's going to sit just off to the north today. That'll also allow the winds to be light today. So we're not going to see much in the way of any wind gusts picking up, but a very light east wind possible. Dry through the day today. Rain is still sitting off to the west. It's trying to edge in by tomorrow morning. That'll be our first chance to bring back some showers early for Sunday. Here comes a warm front moving our way and with it quite a bit of moisture. So our dew points heading up tomorrow. It's going to feel a little uh, more muggy for Sunday. And in an area of low pressure on the back side. That low pressure is going to move west to east right into our direction and until it clears the region, we will have a chance for rounds of rain and then eventually as the low pressure gets closer, the better chance for thunderstorms to be mixed in or even some stronger storms when it moves overhead for Monday. So we get into it starting for Sunday. This is Sunday evening at 10 p.m. Some firework concerns there with rounds of rain possible. Some embedded thunderstorms will continue that chance Sunday night into Monday morning and then linger storms chances into Monday evening. Our future cast is 7 o'clock this evening. Mostly cloudy skies dry for any fireworks tonight. Tomorrow morning could be waking up to some showers arriving already. May see a little bit prolonged periods of rain at times on Sunday and then Sunday night into Monday. Here comes some heavier bands rolling in. So fireworks on Sunday evening could be a problem. If you're camping out Sunday night to Monday morning, plan on soaking rain at times. Monday afternoon, we still have rounds of rain by Monday evening and especially our southern counties. I think we're looking at some of this to be thunderstorms and the potential for some stronger storms at that for Monday evening. That's on the 4th of July. Here's a look at the computer model kind of painting in that rain several inches across Missouri and Illinois. It does taper a little bit as it uh, overhead for us. So models have backed off just a touch in the last 24 hours, but we're still talking one to two inches and because of that a flood threat, especially Sunday night into Monday heaviest rain during that time period, a couple of strong storms Monday afternoon or evening still a possibility that could be uh, interacting with some fireworks forecasts on the 4th of July evening for tonight. You're a go if you have firework plans tomorrow night rounds of rain, a possibility some embedded thunderstorms on Monday night for the 4th of July, some strong storms even possible high today of 80 degrees dry during the day as our clouds thicken and tonight still pretty nice. We drop off to 64 a few showers by morning, a possibility then we get into the rain and we'll continue with that into Monday. After that, scattered showers Tuesday and hot and muggy conditions return next week with scattered storms and highs in the low to mid 90s.